What's good, sneaker fam? Welcome back to our sneakers. I keep taking L's with this damn mic. I keep forgetting to turn it on. I don't know how these YouTubers do it, but I just keep forgetting and I keep leaving it off. This is actually my second time doing this video. If you do want to see the Yeezy experiment that I did with this shoe, you can go over to my other channel. I did do a social experiment with the Yeezys. The name of my other channel is called R Life. All you gotta type in is R space Life, L-Y-F-E. Or you can go ahead and find the link to my other channel in the description down below. The video will be uploaded tomorrow, so make sure to subscribe when you go over to that channel. Turn your notifications on so you do get notified when I upload the video tomorrow. So like I said, this is my second time recording this, and as you guys can see, I already did it on one shoe, but I'm gonna do it on this shoe as well. Thank God I haven't dissected this shoe yet, so let's get on to it. So the two things you need is gonna be an X-Acto knife and obviously the pair of shoes. This is a pretty simple project. All you gotta do is lift up the heel tab pretty hard because it is coming off anyways. It doesn't matter if it rips or anything. And once you lift it up far enough, you should be able to see some string on the corner of the little square that holds down the heel tab. And then with the X-Acto knife, you lightly want to just start scraping it and it will rip off by itself. And you gotta do it all the way around the square. You could pull it a little sometimes and it will lift off by itself. But there'll be times where it's gonna get kind of hard, so you do use X-Acto knife to keep scraping it off. Once you have one side of the heel tab off, you can grab the little stitching that's coming out of the shoe and just pull it off their hand. And if it's being stubborn, you could use tweezers or use your mouth. It doesn't really matter. On this particular pair, there was a piece of string that was being stubborn and I couldn't pull it out with my hand or with my teeth. So I had to actually pull it straight and then just use X-Acto knife to cut it as close to the primate as possible without cutting the primate, of course. So it sits evenly flush and you can't even notice it. And once you do one side, it's pretty simple. You gotta do it to the other side and then to the shoe as well, and you're all done. It's that easy of a project. Of course I can't forget the fan of the day, and today's fan of the day is Daniel Mogoza. If you did enjoy the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe. We are trying to get to 10,000 subscribers by my birthday, which lands on April 22nd. And if we do so, I will begin a Yeezy giveaway. So make sure to subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. Make sure to share the video with your friends, and make sure they subscribe as well. So we do start that Yeezy giveaway. Make sure you stay woke. Well. Arsenic is signed out. Peace.